what is up sis welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Kensha and welcome so girl I have my very first Goose Creek haul to show y'all I'm super excited about this haul and if you're interested in what I got then stay tuned right, sis. so I've been look I've been doing some research watching videos left and right about Goose Creek some of the main people that I've been watching is Tisha Keen I really really enjoy her videos and I've also been watching the Santa Maria her channel because she does nothing but candle reviews so yeah they've kind of inspired me to buy some stuff from goose creek so upon opening up my box goose creek puts coupons in a box like what they give you like a 15 percent off coupon off the shower gel that's crazy because you know like bath and body works used to put like coupons in your orders but now they don't do that so to see that Goose Creek is doing that, that's like kind of like drawing me in like, okay, what else can I buy from y'all? Because y'all didn't get me 15% off off my next order. So with this order, they had a sale and you have to go to their website to like really see their sales. I did their Memorial Day promotion, which was six candles for $60. So it was $10 a candle and your girl was like, oh my God, like this is the perfect time for me to try their products. So let me go ahead and go to the website and see what I can get. So I have, let's see, four, six, eight, eight candles. And then I have three lotions and two hand soaps to show y'all i got one of the lotions for free and i was like oh i got a free item yes <laughs> so the first thing i bought from them was a moisturizing shower gel this is in watermelon lemonade not that i need anything else in watermelon lemonade i do have products from bath and body works this watermelon lemonade and also victoria's secret their melon sorbet type of scent is also kind of like a watermelon lemonade type of scent so i was like mm, i feel like watermelon lemonade is a safe scent to try in any brand so i was like you know what let me go ahead and get this in the shower gel because you know it's, it'll go with something that's already in my collection so oh y'all this smells super artificial but it's sweet it reminds me of um the jolly rancher jolly rancher um watermelon lemonade well not watermelon lemonade but watermelon flavor i more so get like an artificial watermelon watermelon scent more so than the lemonade but it smells like a jolly watermelon to me so yeah, this this smells good. Um, super artificial though. Um, scent notes are juicy summer watermelon, which is what I get. Freshly squeezed lemonade and pure sugarcane. So yeah, it it literally smells like watermelon to me. I don't get any lemonade. I'll have to see when I get in the shower what this truly smells like. But that's just like my first impression of this scent. Next up, we have some hand soaps. This is in Lush Getaway, and y'all, the packaging just really pulled me in. It just looks like a, literally like a getaway. It kind of reminds me of like Italy, like you know how you see photos of Italy and all the water and like all of the houses and I don't know. It just reminds me of like a getaway. This is what I would imagine a getaway to Italy would look like. I also got this scent in the soothing body lotion the packaging just really pulled me in scent notes are strawberry raspberry colorful clouds cashmere and soft citrus mm. i don't know i don't really smell nothing Y'all, I don't really smell nothing in this. Um, <laughs> uh, 
let me let me see what this lotion talking about because that I don't really smell nothing. It could just be my nose. But let's see. Oh, that's kind of cool. It's kind of different. You have to pull it up from the top to open it. You have to pull it from the top instead of just squeezing the back part. You have to literally pull the front to open. So let's see. I didn't got so many scents on me. I might not be able to smell it. And that little bit of lotion I put on covered a lot of surface area. Um, this don't smell like nothing. Y'all, I don't smell anything. This just smells like an unscented lotion. That's weird. I literally don't get any scent from Lush Getaway. <laughs> That's not good. Yeah, I don't get anything. That's really weird. Um, hopefully, I'm able to smell the other lotions and uh, hand soaps. Okay, so the next one I picked up was Rays for Days. I also got this in the soothing body lotion the packaging just screams summer to me um the scent notes are pineapple lush melon clementine and soft sandalwood so i'm gonna try the lotion this time instead of the hand lotion i mean the hand soap i'm just gonna go ahead and open this up because i don't want to have to waste my time Okay, so this actually smells like it says. It kind of reminds me of something that I already have. So it's pineapple and lush melon. I definitely get the melon and the pineapple, more so the pineapple with the hint of melon. It's sweet. The pineapple definitely smells a little bit artificial, but it smells good. What does this remind me of? This reminds me something in my collection that I already have. I don't know if it's just a pineapple note that's making me automatically think of pineapple coconut, but this doesn't have any coconut in it. Is that the scent I'm thinking that it smells like? If I can think of the scent, um, I'll let you guys know what I think um, this smells like, but it smells good. I mean, it smells like a true summer scent, something that you would definitely wear in the summertime. The item that I got for free um, is a soothing body lotion. This is in Beach Dreams. Look at that cute packaging, y'all. I really like their packaging. They make it look, look realistic. Um, I love the boss sickle with the sunset background. Let's see what this smells like. Scent notes are vanilla bean, clementine, red apple, and sandalwood. And so this is going to be a more fruity scent. So we'll see. This is another one I really can't smell. That's so weird. If you have Goose Creek products, let me know. Like, are you able to smell the lotions? Like, because this literally smells like nothing. I feel like I get a hint of vanilla, but that's it. Like, I don't get any red apple, any clementine or sandalwood. Mm. luckily i got these for like three bucks because i don't just based off first impressions and barely being able to smell these i don't think i would purchase this again truly but you know i'm just gonna like give these all a try and because if they're super moisturizing then of course you know i would buy more but i would definitely be careful of the scents I picked because these two scents I don't know why I can't smell them I'm gonna have to ask my fiance when he gets home if he can smell these because 
I can't smell Beach Dreams or Lush Getaway. I get no scent from them. I get a hint of vanilla in the Beach Dreams, but it's super, super, super light. It's almost like barely there. So let's get into the start of this haul. I got eight candles. First up is Georgia Peach. The packaging just really, really drew me in for Georgia Peach. Look at those juicy peaches on the packaging. Super, super cute. And these are three wick candles as well. I don't know if you guys will be able to see the inside, but y'all. So the packaging of the candles just really drew me in. And <laughs> this is automatically making my mouth water. To me, it does smell like a true peach when you first cut it open. Like if you got like a really, really juicy peach, the one that's like when you cut it open, the juice is just dripping everywhere. I love those kind of peaches. But it also reminds me of sour peach rings as well. Hmm. But I guess it kind of smells like an artificial peach in a sense. I don't know, y'all. It kind of reminds me of peach rings. But then again, it also reminds me of a real peach. Which one is it? <laughs> I would say this reminds me, it's, this is true to the scent. It, true, true to the name, sorry guys. This is true to the name. It literally smells like a Georgia peach. A juicy Georgia peach. It has my mouth water smells super good i cannot wait to burn that one this is a popular one that i picked up this is key lime cake pop i do like um bakery scents for my house um oh this smells good this literally smells like a key lime pie so yeah that is the packaging for the cake pop key lime pie this doesn't have the these candles do not have the scent notes at the bottom. Um, I would just think lime and some type of cream and cake, vanilla cake maybe. But um, if I can remember, I will insert the scent, the scent notes down at the bottom of the screen. But yeah, this smells really, really good. It literally smells like cake pop. It smells like a really, really sweet bakery scent. So next candle i picked up was banana cabana beach i picked this one up because of the beach scene that it has i love the water it literally you're literally at the beach with this scent um i'm not sure of the scent notes but i will leave them down below mm, what am i getting from this this literally smells like pineapple mixed with something and banana this smells really good so yeah that is banana cabana beach i'm gonna try to pull up these scent notes really fast cabana are banana tangerine coconut and sea breeze i definitely get the banana and coconut in here it smells really juicy almost like a drink so yeah i can't wait to burn this one it doesn't seem like it's going to be a very strong scent. It would be like maybe like a super light scent based on just what I'm smelling um, right out the, from the top. Next scent I picked up was Lake House Retreat. I really like just picked this up. This just reminds me of a house that you would go to when camping. So yeah, love that. Let's see what this smells like. This... I don't like this one. <laughs> I, I don't like this. Mm, it smells outdoory, but it's like a peppery or some type of note in this that I don't like. Um, it has citrus, lavender, cedarwood, and warm woods. Mm, I don't know about this one. I don't like this one at all. It smells like there's like a pepper note. Mm, I don't like this. And it's definitely not the cedar wood in this. Yeah, I don't like this. This one's a little funky. I don't like this one. Next up, I picked up 
um, Mimosa Sea Spray. I really love the purple wax on it and it also matches the background. Scent notes for Mimosa Sea Spray is Mimosa, Mango, Pineapple, and Sugar. Now this one is the one. This one smells really good, y'all. This is true to the name. You definitely get that sweet mango on pineapple and sugar. Like, I really like this one. I cannot wait to burn this. I'll probably burn this one first um, than all the other ones. Next up, I picked up Beach Kiss. Super cute romantic little packaging with a couple in the background with the sun setting. I don't know about this one, y'all. I don't know about this one. <laughs> mm. It smells okay. This isn't my favorite that I've bought, but the scent notes is apricot, strawberry, limeade, and island sunset. I think I'm smelling more so apricot and strawberry. And it's just okay. I, this will probably be the last one. Next to the last one that I burned. Because I don't... I don't think I... I don't really care too much for this one. This one's just okay. Like if I were to smell this in the store, it would just be staying where it's at. Because it's just okay. Um, I also picked up ice cream. This is... Um, this is from the ice cream collection. This is strawberry shortcake. I have really high hopes for strawberry shortcake. <laughs> oh yeah, this is good. This literally smells like strawberry shortcake. This smells, this reminds me of Bath and Body Works. Strawberry pound cake. Oh yeah, that smells really good. That's what it looks like. So let me pull up the scent notes for this one. So, scent notes for a strawberry shortcake is creamy ice cream, pink strawberries, and vanilla shortcake. And y'all, that is the perfect, perfect, perfect scent notes for this because it smells identical to that. This smells a lot like strawberry pound cake to me from Bath and Body Works. So yeah, this is basically like a dupe. Smells super good. Just in the ice cream form. <laughs> Last but not least, I picked up Carnival Dreams. Mm, this reminds me of something just off of just Coat Sniff. It definitely reminds me of something like back in my childhood. You guys remember those like little Indian um, air fresheners? That's what this kind of reminds me of. I don't know if it's called Indian air fresheners, but I'll try to post like a picture of it of what I'm talking about. But this smells, this smells like one of those. Um, so Carnival Dreams. Scent notes are wild berry, sponge sugar, vanilla, and drink sweet dreams. I definitely get that berry note with the vanilla and the sponge sugar. But this is another scent that's just okay for me. Um Yeah, if it was at the stove, if I smelled it at the stove, it would just be at the stove. So yeah. <laughs> That is my first impression haul video of Goose Creek. Um, you guys already know this is my favorite. Out of the, all the candles that I got, this is Starberry Shortcake. It smells super good on cold. It smells just like the scent notes. And Lake House Retreat was my least favorite. So yeah, that is everything in this haul. If you had, have not already, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And also, girl, let me know if you've ever bought anything from Goose Creek. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.